Hello everyone. Welcome to Art Appreciation. My name is Monica Lynn James and I'm very excited to be your instructor this quarter. Over the course of the next 10 weeks, we'll be taking a look at the history of art from the beginning of time, um, the beginning of human time, to um, about the medieval time period. We are going to explore art across the globe from many different countries and many different places. We'll learn about the elements of art and principles of design, which are some universal vocabulary and language that we can use both to talk about art, but also to get in deeper and interpret and analyze what does it mean. Um, and also learning to research and look at history to find out what did the artist mean and what was happening during those time periods that the art was created. So we'll delve into some critical thinking, some research, and lots of art. As you can see behind me, <laughs> I have my paints ready and probably even my little drawing pad here set up. My perspective towards art comes from being an artist myself. I studied art um, going to school to get my bachelor's degree in printmaking, and I have a master's degree in painting. So you'll also see lots of videos and experiences because what excites me and interests me is how it was made um, and some of the fascinating techniques um, that were used to carve marble or to create um, Greek vases. How did they um, learn to change the firing or use different clays to get different colors? Um, how was the first paint made? Uh, so each unit you'll see different both reading and sometimes viewing materials, some great videos from Smart History uh, that help us to really experience the work of art as close as we can to being there. And um, those reading and viewing assignments, by the way, they're all free. This class has an open education resource, which is kind of a collection of articles and free online materials that we're using instead of the textbook. So you'll see each kind of chunk as a folder in Canvas, and everything that you'll need is in Canvas, well, except yourself. <laughs> each week, we'll follow those reading and viewing assignments with some kind of assignment. It will sometimes be a check for understanding, which is my new language for quiz. I know quizzes kind of freak us out, so I call them a check for understanding. And it really is a check because if you mess up, I want you to go back and take it again. I want to make sure you learn that content and learn that material. So you can take each check twice. Um, and then we have some discussions where we will be critically thinking and writing about what we're learning or even um, exploring and bringing new things to the table. We'll have some hands-on projects in there. Um, for each discussion, I have a variety of questions that you can choose from. Um, and some of them will be some hands-on projects. So I'm really looking forward to working with all of you this uh, quarter and sharing my love of art with you. I hope that it helps you to uh, discover um, the world of art or ways that you can um, enjoy that in your life, uh, even beyond this class. Um, and um, please let me know if you ever have any questions or need any help. I'm only an email away. So uh, please say hello and we'll get to know each other in the introduction discussion. And I um, hope we have a really great quarter, everybody. Look forward to getting to know you. Thank you.